What's up guys, welcome to Football Talk Friday number eight. This week we are bringing you Trade Right Gun, Scat Right, Gator, H Hook O, a great completion play, just a drive starter. And not only do we have the play breakdown, but we have a video breakdown of the 2013 St. Louis Rams running this week one against the Arizona Cardinals. As always, let's get better and I hope you enjoy. What's up guys, welcome to Football Talk number one. Right now we're looking at Twins Right, Scat Right, F Shift. What you're going to look for is your F on the show. Football Talk Friday number 8. This week's play breakdown is Trade Right Gun, Scat Right, Gator, H Hook O, and the video breakdowns from the 2013 St. Louis Rams offense running this week 1 against the Arizona Cardinals. We're going to go ahead and we're going to look at the personnel formation, protection, and play to start. Personnel is 12, meaning one back and two tight ends. Our back is the H, and in Trade Right Gun, our two tight ends are the F and the Y. Trade right gun, again, a T means three by one, but trade means we're going to put the Y all the way outside. We'll bump the Z to the slot, and we'll put the F on the ball four yards away from this right tackle. Protection is scat right, and the play is Gator H hook O. The play caller's purpose is completion. Footwork for the quarterback is three plant from the gun. And the pure progression, a pure progression means a quarterback's going from one to two to three and so on and so forth no matter the coverage. It doesn't matter if he gets cover one, if he gets quarters, he's going to work that pure progression every time. This pure progression is number one is the spark, then you'll work to the shin six, and then you'll work to the hook out. Let's start with this spark route. It's got man zone principles. If there's a void in the defense, meaning the mic works away and the Sam widens and there's just a void, the spark's going to work up five steps and turn inside just like a hitch or a stick route. If they get zone, they're going to lean in to create a little bit of tight separation. They're going to work in tight toward this mic and then turn outside to create a window for the quarterback to drill it into. If they get true man-to-man, -man, what you're going to see them do is work one step, four steps on the slant, pivot, and then break out. Obviously, in man coverage, you're going to get a lot of times the linebacker is going to work inside out on these slot receivers. So they're going to lean on him and then break to try to create separation in man coverage. Then you're going to work to your shin six. Your shin six is exploding through 12 yards, really giving them that vertical presence. Then they're going to roll cut to 16 yards. We put friendly. What friendly means is staying flat and working back towards the quarterback so you don't let the secondary player undercut this shin six. If the quarterback doesn't like the shin six, they're going to reset and hit the hook O. Obviously, the back checks protection, works up to five yards, turns in on zone, or breaks flat out in man. Okay, the Z and the Y, the bender and the go, they are not in this progression, but their routes are still very important to the play. The Z is on a bender, meaning at 12 yards, if it's middle of the field close, let's say the free safety is in the middle of the field and it's cover three, they're going to stay on the seam route and they're going to work right up the, they're going to work up two yards inside edge of the numbers, the pro numbers. If you get middle of the field open, meaning it's cover two or it's split safety, they're going to work up through 12 yards and break and their aiming point on this cover two post is 18 to 22 yards on the near hash. The go outside is a wide must outside release, meaning they have to outside release this defender. We want to get this defender's eyes to turn away from where the spark route's going to come and influence, and we're going to get wide, and we're going to run this guy off, and that's our go route from the Y. Let's go ahead and look at the tape. First thing you'll notice on the tape is that second and nine is the situation, and we'll start to let this thing roll. So you're going to see the Rams are in trade right gun, and you're going to see right here, the Arizona Cardinals are in a 3-4 base defense. They've got three defensive linemen right here, one, two, three. They've got their line, they've got their will linebacker up on the ball, and Sam is walked out head up of number three. What you're going to see them end up doing is he's going to drop out. You're going to see the Sam fire off the edge, and you're going to see Bradford take his three plant, and he's going to work this spark route. That the, that the F is running on this play because we're in trade right gun. The Arizona Cardinals roll to a middle of the field closed look, which is why you're going to get the bender to stay on the seam. You'll get the outside release go, which really clears up a ton of ground. And you're going to see after we catch the spark for the F to get up the field and go ahead and get a first down on second and nine. So let's let this thing run. First thing to notice right on the snap is you see the will is bailing out and you see the Sam flashing off the edge. One, two, three, ball on him. The spark works out. We make the mic miss. Go ahead and get up 10 yards. A huge first down on second and nine. We'll look at the tight. Again, you see they're in their base three, four. We would call this an under front 
because we've got the shade on the center. We've got the three technique weak, three tech meaning he's on that outside shoulder of the weak guard. And then we're going to count him as a five. We would count this as an under front, even though it's three, four personnel. What you're going to see, Sam, one, two, three. He's going to work out. I want you guys to, we're going to rewind that. Watch this spark route. It's going to flash into your screen right here and watch him work in and then watch the reverse pivot as he breaks out. Work in, reverse pivot, breaks out. Bang, put it on the outside shoulder. We're going to make the mic miss, get up the field, go get 10 yards and a first down on a super easy completion play, super easy read for the quarterback. I hope you guys enjoyed this week's play breakdown of trade right gun, scat right gator H hooko.